Hello again from the RS Lab. Since we posted the demonstration of Quake, a number of people have asked if we could possibly do a multiplayer game or even actually connect to the internet and play Quake Live. So today we're going to attempt to give you a demonstration of Quake Live. So to do this, we've actually got two Raspberry Pis running. So we just one on the screen to the left here, and we just pan across to the screen on the right. And you see we've already got this one running Quake 3. Just to prove that we are using Raspberry Pis and haven't cheated, we'll just come down here and you'll see two Raspberry Pis in front of the keyboard, all lit up and running with LEDs glowing, all connected via HDMI to the television sets and connected to Ethernet via the patch cables here. Uh, we're just connected via a normal modem router on an ADSL line, so the ping times aren't that great. Uh, however, we are hopefully be able to show you this running. So a colleague here will just start up the Quake game on this monitor here. So we'll go into multiplayer mode. And you can immediately see the server list for Quake Live building up there. Now what we need to do is pick a server that actually matches the maps that we've got installed on our machine. So we'll just attempt to find that now. As you can see we're attempting to connect to the server. And unfortunately, we've failed for an invalid password there, so we'll just try another one. There are hundreds of servers out there. Just need to find one that works for us. So it looks like second time lucky. And then we'll just go in and we'll play the game. As you can see, still reasonably fast. In fact, we didn't last long that time. Again, very acceptable performance playing live over the internet. So we're getting frame rates up to about 50 frames per second even now. And another demonstration of what you can do with a Raspberry Pi. So thanks for watching. We will actually attempt to do a multiplayer game as well and post the video of that. Uh, if you've got any questions, just let us know via the site. Thanks for watching.